Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Simona and today we are not going to be doing any deco denning. We are actually going to be going through my lovely organization piece of furniture I got over here. It's a 15 drawer like plastic, you know, guy. It actually rolls around. It's great. And we're just going to go drawer by drawer and I'm going to show you what is inside of each of them. Please make sure that you have entered the giveaway if you're interested in getting a free deco den case as well as a pair of earrings. I have the instructions on that in that video. That's the video before this one. I also talk about it a little bit at the end of this video if you're interested. But uh, thank you so much for being a subscriber to this channel and thank you for liking this video already. Alright, let's get started. So, in here... I got this awesome uh, little plastic furniture with 15 drawers on it from Amazon. It's very handy dandy. The only thing is uh, that the drawers, uh, they go in and out just fine, but since they're made of plastic, they kind of like scrape against the metal and they kind of like shape off a little bit as you go. So you get all these little dusties everywhere, but uh, other than anything, it's good. It works fine. It has a nice, you know, clean area up here at the top where I keep my sandpaper. And uh, it fits nicely in my closet, which is behind me, behind this gold thing. You know, I wasn't going to organize that, so here we go. So let's get sweating. Over here at the top, this is a heavy drawer. I keep silicone and tape. So this isn't all the silicone I have. Some of the silicone is still in boxes inside of my closet, but this is what I have handy dandy on me. And then I have rolls of tape for shipping. And I also have my icing bags. So these are the type of icing bags that I use. They come in a pack of like 200 and they're awesome. They're very thin. Uh, it comes a lot in a pack and it's all in Chinese on it. So I don't know what it says other than it says master. That's all I can read on this. But yeah, these, these guys, I also buy them on Amazon. They come in a pack of 200, so pretty hand dandy. Okay, so this thing of drawers is what's next to me when I'm working. What's great about this whole uh, thing is that it has casters at the bottom with wheels, so I can wheel it around the room and uh, have it right next to me whenever I need it. In the next drawer, I have some molds. So these are silicone molds for resin. So for example, here you got some hearts and some bats. Oh, I can't see that. There you go, some bats. Uh, the rest of my molds, there's actually a lot more than this. They're just behind me on top of my desk because I'm actually making resin pieces. So this drawer is usually much heavier. But uh, you know, you got a little skeleton here. Next drawer, I have all of my fabric paints. So these are the fabric paints that I use for the sides of the foam cases. So they're just kind of thrown in there, like so. Uh, I try to keep a good stock of them. Again, I get those from Amazon. I'm not sponsored. Next drawer, I have all of the little organza bags where I put my um, my cases when they're finished. I put them inside these little baggies along with some business cards. These are my old business cards. I think in here I just have the old ones. The new ones are on top of my uh, dresser over there. But yeah, that's where I keep those bags. I have two size bags. I have the big ones for the phone cases and the little ones for the earrings, which I remembered to put on today. She did it. <laughs> Can you guess where I get those bags? Um, yes. I have a drawer that has a bunch of dice to be made into earrings. Sometimes I keep earrings here for me to wear. But yeah, I just have them in bags. You know, bags of dice. Onto this side. So on this side we have five drawers and over here we have ten. Correct? Three, 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 one. Yes. Ten drawers on the right side, five drawers on the left side, 15 drawers to the left. She's really good. All right, so let's start from the bottom here. I have a drawer full of pop sockets. So these are pop sockets that are like character pop sockets, like this little thumb hook. 
But I also have some resin pieces. Some of them don't have the backing of the pop socket just yet. And some of them do. And this is where I keep all of the pop socket heads. Uh, the body of the pop socket, like the part that actually pops, I keep that on my desk so that I have it nearby when I'm making a case. Yum. All right, in the next drawer, I have a drawer with characters in it. So these are all different characters from different anime. I try to keep like movie and anime characters in here. So for example, I have some Sailor Moon pieces, Seven Deadly Sins over here, Demon Slayer, Hanako-kun. Yeah, I have uh, all of like character like anime or uh, comic book or TV show characters on here. And some Star Wars. Look at that. So that's where I keep it, all nice and juicy. I have a drawer where I put all of my black, white, and pink. So yeah, I, these are all resin pieces that I've made using the silicone mold. Or some of them are pieces that I purchased, like a set. Like for example, I have a bunch of like little roses. I have some hearts, some moons, you know, everything you can imagine. Some things that are cute. Next, I have my cool tone. So by cool tone, I mean blues, greens, and purples. Right there. Have some blues, purples, and greens. So again, resin pieces I've made, as well as some uh, pieces that I purchased. The next drawer is going to be warm colors. So red, oranges, and yellows. Here we go. Have this big star that came with some pieces and I'll use it somewhere. So same concept, just these three colors. And then I have a drawer that these are characters, but they're all either Disney or Sanrio characters, meaning like Hello Kitty, Gudetama. Uh, I also put Kirby in here because I just wanted to. Um, but yeah, these are more characters from Sanrio and Disney. So I have some like Disney princess stuff as well. Oh, and I also have BTS in here. I keep it separate from the other one because that's just how I want it separated. That's it. Just easier for me to think of like where a specific character might be, either in this drawer or in the other drawer. Next drawer, we have my glitters and micas. So I keep my black and white micas and inks over on my desk. This is everything else. So this whole uh, part right here is all little mica like powder in different colors. And then over here I have my holographic and uh, iridescent uh, glitters. And these range from like fat glitters to like really thin glitters, you know, they're just there visually so can see them. Next, I have my inks. So these are all alcohol inks. I also keep my nail polishes in here to paint my nails when I feel like it. And I also have these baggies that have uh, glow in the dark powder. I just keep them in here because they're great. And yeah, so alcohol inks, they come in these little bottles. As I said, the black and the white are over on my desk um, for easy access. All right, in here, I keep a handy stash of the bags that I put the earrings in, as well as the earring hooks. I keep them inside of these bags. And I keep all of these keychains pieces for whenever uh, somebody asks for a keychain or for whenever I order a charm and it comes attached on a keychain, I put it in here. Uh, yeah, and then just more earrings earring backs and stuff. And then up here, I have all of my ribbon that I use for the cases. I keep them mainly stored, wrapped around these pieces of cardboard so that I can see the colors. These guys have not been properly though, well, but this is usually what it looks like. Mm -hmm. Ah, organized by color. I swear this is a piece, a good piece of furniture. All right, so those are those, that's that. So 
So let me know if you want to know anything else of my process or how I organize stuff. I've had a couple of people tell me on comments um, that I'm very organized. Thank you. I'm not. Once again, if you are interested, I am actually running a giveaway on my previous video before this one where you can actually win a custom decorative case for whatever device you have and uh, you get a pair of earrings of your choice as well so if you're interested in joining us for that giveaway that'd be awesome hey there folks forgot to mention that the giveaway deadline is wednesday august 5th so make sure that you uh go over to that video and uh do all the stuff i will be pinning the winning comment thanks bye uh so all you have to do is go over to that video. You're going to be subscribed to this channel, that's number one. Number two is you're going to like that video and leave a comment below on that video. Any comment will do. Uh, it doesn't matter how many comments because you're only entered once. And good luck to everybody and thank you for everybody that's already subscribed and has already liked this video. Uh, and feel free to leave a comment down below saying hi or uh, whatever you want to tell me. Tell me about your day. Thank you for joining me today. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for liking. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!